Thank you for choosing to watch this video. It has now been a week since the last race. Honestly, the saying that says the truth hurts has been very apropos for the way I felt for the last week. I don't know how many of you remember in 1978, I believe when Nicky Lauder had test driven a Ferrari F1, obviously, and Enzo asked him how he felt and he called it a piece of ass, and he called the car, drove. he said the Ferrari drove like a truck. And so was very, very unhappy. Also bring back memories of last year, when Lewis Hamilton had complained about the Mercedes, and Toto went on to say that Lewis Hamilton made the team feel like a vomit bag. Well, for those of you who are fans of the sport like I am, Mercedes made me feel worse. It's been a week for me to have the ability to express the way I felt. Because Mercedes talking about plan B almost seemed like it was a premeditated. It appears now that anyone but Lewis is the winning strategy in Formula 1. That's clear. Max Verstappen's victory brings more money to Formula 1 than Lewis Hamilton's. Fernando's victory brings more money to Formula One than Lewis Hamilton's. Indeed, the sport of Formula One is a European sport. What I can't accept is the game. The fact that it appears since Abu Dhabi that Formula One, Toto Wolf, the FIA, has known all along that maybe the theater is good for the sport. Just think about what could happen if Mercedes come from behind and Lewis wins his eighth title. Just think about what could happen if Lewis Hamilton gets one year extension contract and moves to Aston Martin and joins Fernando. Lewis versus Fernando would be huge for the sport. The sport is less and less a sport to me and I'm more and more disappointed and I'm losing the fire that made me fall in love with the sport. 